हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अनदर सीरीज ऑफ इन न्यूज टुडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज लुधियाना गैस लीक फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द न्यूज देन वी विल डिस्कस व्हाट हैज हैपेंड इन लुधियाना पॉसिबिलिटीज हाइड्रोजन सल्फाइड व्हाट आर न्यूरोटॉक्सिन्स व्हाई आर दे सो डेंजरस एंड व्हाट आर न्यूरोटॉक्सिक गैसेस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स डिस्कस अबाउट द न्यूज ऑन संडे मॉर्निंग दैट इज अप्रैल थर्टी इलेवन पीपल डाइट ड्यू टू अ गैस लीक इन द गायसपुरा एरिया ऑफ लुधियाना पंजाब वाइल फोर पीपल फेल इल एंड वर हॉस्पिटलाइज एनी डेफिनेटिव रीजन फॉर द लीक आर नॉट नोन सो फार अ मेजिस्टीरियल इंक्वायरी इन टू द इंसिडेंट हैज बीन इनिशिएटेड अकॉर्डिंग टू द इन द एयर क्वालिटी सेंसर्स यूज बाय नेशनल डिजास्टर रिस्पॉन्स फोर्स टीम हाई लेवल्स ऑफ हाइड्रोजन सल्फाइड गैस अ काइंड ऑफ न्यूरोटॉक्सिन हैव बीन डिटेक्टेड it is being ascertained how this gas might have led to the incident now let's understand what actually happened in ludhiana the gaspur area of ludhiana has several factories and is a thickly populated area it is suspected that poisonous gas may have emanated from a partially open manhole in the locality and spread to the shops and houses nearby the autopsy reports suggested that the deaths were due to inhalation poisoning the cause of death has come out as inhalation poisoning but the type of poison will be clear only after viscera examination hydrogen sulfide is so toxic that even one breath of it taken inside can kill a person probably some acidic waste was thrown into sewer which reacted with methane carbon monoxide and other sewerage gases to produce hydrogen sulfide now let's have a look at the possibilities there are several possibilities that may lead to high concentration of hydrogen sulfide it indicates that the sewerage system was not cleaned properly due to which the gas formation continued there were no events within the sewerage system to let the gases escape Now if we talk about hydrogen sulfide it is also known as H2S sewer gas swamp gas stink damp and sewer damp it is a colorless gas known for its pungent rotten egg odor at low concentrations it is extremely flammable and highly toxic hydrogen sulfide is used or produced in a number of industries such as oil and gas refining mining tanning pulp and paper processing rayon manufacturing etc hydrogen sulfide also occurs naturally in sewers manure pits well water oil and gas wells and volcanoes because it is heavier than air hydrogen sulfide can collect in low lying and enclosed spaces such as manholes sewers and underground telephone walls its presence makes work in confined spaces potentially very dangerous The health effects of hydrogen sulfide depend on how much H2S a worker breathes and for how long. However, many effects are seen even at low concentrations. Effects range from mild headaches or eye irritation to very serious unconsciousness and death. Now let's understand what are neurotoxins. Neurotoxins are poisonous substances which can directly affect the nervous system. Neurotoxicity occurs when exposure to natural or man-made Toxic substances alters the normal activity of the nervous system. These substances can eventually disrupt or even kill neurons or nerve cells which are important for transmitting and processing signals in the brain and other parts of the nervous system. Now why are they so dangerous? They directly attack the respiratory tract of the body thereby overpowering the oxygen concentration of the body and then the nervous system as well. And what are neurotoxic gases? Methane, hydrogen sulfide, carbon monoxide and carbon dioxide are common neurotoxic gases. While methane and carbon monoxide are odorless gases, hydrogen sulfide has a pungent odor and in higher concentration it can be fatal for humans. In the present case, it is likely that a chemical might have reacted with methane gas that is generated during the breakdown of human waste. Samples of sewage were taken from nearby manholes to assess this. To remove gases such as hydrogen sulfide from wastewater chemical oxidation is done where oxidants such as hydrogen peroxide are added to the wastewater now it's time for the practice question hydrogen sulfide is used or produced in which of the following industries 1 oil and gas refining 2 mining 3 tanning 4 pulp and paper processing 
Select the correct answer using the following codes 1 and 2 only, 2 and 3 only, 1 and 3 only or all of the above. So that's all for today. Stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks for watching.